traveled the world to compete, and now these Bay Area dancers are this year's opening act of the Chinese New Year's Parade. Tonight, enjoy a sneak peek and learn why this local performance is so significant. Plus, a warning for homeowners in the South Bay, what police say some thieves are accused of doing before breaking in. Next at 10. This is the 10 o'clock news on KTVU. San Francisco's Chinese New Year Parade less than 24 hours away. Tonight, floats are getting those finishing touches as the city prepares to welcome hundreds of thousands of people. We've been working for months on this. We have teams of 20 to 30 people, and I think people sometimes forget how much actually goes into bringing these to life. It's a lot. San Francisco all decked out, ready to celebrate the Year of the Dragon. Good evening. It's Friday. I'm Christina Rondo. And I'm Greg Lee. Tonight, the community gathered for the Miss Chinatown USA pageant, another major event leading up to the annual Chinese New Year Parade. KTV's Amber Lee joins us live from San Francisco. Amber, a lot of excitement ahead of tomorrow. Greg, that's right. There is a lot of excitement as we wait for pageant officials to name the new Miss Chinatown USA. Right now, we're at Union Square. This is the broadcast center. Right next to me over here are the bleachers that were set up earlier today. And this is where the parade will go by. We went to several locations to show you the work that's being done to prepare for that huge, spectacular parade tomorrow. 